former Alabama quarterback Jay Barker was arrested in Nashville after allegedly attempting to hit two people with a vehicle early Saturday morning, according to court documents. Barker, 49, was charged with one count of felony aggravated assault with a deadly weapon. Court records indicate he was to be held for 12 hours because the charge related to domestic violence. His arrest booking report lists him by his full name of Harry Jerome Barker. The Tennessean does not name victims of domestic violence. Documents on file with Metro Nashville General Sessions Court said the people in the vehicle were leaving a party around 1.30 a.m. Saturday. As they pulled into the driveway of a nearby home, Barker allegedly reversed his vehicle at a high rate of speed attempting to hit them, but missed, according to the arrest affidavit. The vehicle's occupants contacted police after Barker drove away from the home, the affidavit states. Police made contact with Barker when he later drove by the house. The passengers of the vehicle and an unidentified number of unnamed witnesses told police Barker intentionally tried to strike them. Barker's bond was set at $10, oh, oh, oh. He is scheduled to appear in court in March. Barker has been married to country music singer Sarah Evans since 2008. Barker led Alabama to the 1992 National Championship, including a victory over No. 1 ranked Miami in the January 1, 1993, Sugar Bowl. He is the school's all-time winningest quarterback with a 35-2-1 record as a starter, and won the Johnny Unitas Golden Arm Award in 1994 as a senior. He finished fifth in Heisman Trophy voting that year. Barker was selected in the fifth round of the 1995 NFL Draft by the Green Bay Packers but was cut from the roster. He spent time with the New England Patriots and Carolina Panthers as a backup but never played in a regular season game. Barker hosts a radio show carried on 100.9 FM in Tuscaloosa as its flagship station. He previously had a morning sports talk radio show with Al Del Greco and Tony Kerr on jocks in Birmingham. Barker's son, Braxton Barker, was a walk-on backup quarterback at Alabama for the past four seasons, 